Wait. Ha <laughs> ha, he died. That there is what I like to call karma. Deal with it. Hey guys, I am Jake, aka the Arbiter 10. I really need a new intro. And we are back playing Oblivion. And we are on our way to Cloud Ruler Temple. So as you can see, I'm at Coral, and we will ride our horse all the way to Cloud Ruler Temple here. I'm joking. Fuck that, we got fast travel. Magically teleport. And after this, I think I may start a Let's Play Dark Brotherhood Oblivion. Wait, I won't even make a side series, I'll just make it next episode, or... I don't know, let me know what you want. Do you want to see the Dark Brotherhood uh, quests, or do you want me to just stick strictly to main quest line? Let me know in the comments. It will be much appreciated. I in your hands. Grandmaster, is this... Yes, Cyrus. This is the Emperor's son, Martin Septim. My lord, welcome to Cloud Ruler Temple. Thank you. We have not had the honor yes. of an Emperor's visit in many Oh, I'm Emperor now? Sweet. Ah, well, thank you. The no, honor he, he is wasn't mine. talking to you, he was talking to me. Come. Your blades are waiting to greet you. Sorry, I'm a little short. I need to jump to talk to you. So, what's my next duty as Emperor? Hey, you gonna tell me anytime soon? I'm pretty I'm pretty good at doing like a booming commanding voice. I can do that for you right now if you want. Just say the word, I'll do it. What do I get to do as emperor? Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. I'll stop that now. Out of my spot. I won't let you take my spot, dude. Blade. I always stand here. Dark times are okay, I always stand here for the, the ceremony. And his sons were slain on our Shove off. The empire is in chaos. But there is yet hope. Here is Dude. Martin Septim, true son of Uriel Septim. Hail, Hail Dragonborn! Hail, Hail Martin Hail. Septim! Hail. Hail! Get on my spot, Highness, Dude. The blades are at your command. You will be safe here until you can take up your throne. Joffrey, all of you. Oh, I know you all expect sorry, sorry, me to be emperor. Sorry. I'll do my best. But this is all new to me. I'm not used to giving speeches, but I, I wanted you to know that I appreciate your welcome here. I hope I prove myself worthy of your loyalty in the coming days. That's it. Thank you. Well then, thank you, Martin. We'd all best get back to our duties, eh, Captain? Good morning, sir. We should. Not much of a speech, was it? Didn't seem to bother them, though. The blade saluting me and hailing me as Martin Septim. I don't mean to sound ungrateful. I know I would be dead by now if it weren't for you. Thank you. But everyone expects me to suddenly know what to do, how to behave. They want an emperor to tell them what to do. And I haven't the faintest idea. We need to get the amulet back. Of course. The amulet of kings. So we... I... can take it to the Temple of the One and light the dragon fires and stop the Oblivion invasion. And you will be the Emperor. Okay, this isn't cool. I thought I was going to be the Emperor. He was totally talking to me. The Emperor? <laughs> That's an idea that will take some getting used to. In any case, we need the amulet first. Maybe Joffrey will know where to start. Amulet of games. All practitioners have... Uh, I'm, not, all I'm not listening to all this. Don't worry about me, I just friend. wanted to check if that was part of the quest line, but it was not. Let's talk to you. You have proven yourself a loyal servant of the Empire, as worthy as any of the Blades to stand by Martin's side during this crisis. As the Grand Master of the Blades, I would be honored to accept you into our order. Will you join us? Hell yeah! It is my honor to welcome you into our ranks as a Knight Brother of the Blades. Okay. And Farewell. I get a cool sword. How cool is that? Pretty cool, huh? Alright. So now that we're part of the Blades, we can commit crimes. Which means I can murder someone. And get into the Dark Brotherhood. And Thieves Guild. 
So, that may be what's coming next. I'm going to talk to Joffrey first, though. It is good to be back here. It raises my spirits just to walk these ancient halls again. We will prevail. We must prevail. Amulet of Kings. You're right. We must try to recover the amulet before the enemy takes it out of our reach. You should go back to the Imperial City. Boris may have learned something about the assassins. You'll find Boris at Luther Broad's boarding house in the Elven Gardens district of the Imperial City. Give my warm regards to Boris. Tell him he should not blame himself for the Emperor's death. Okay, we are going to go to Boris and talk to the Imperial City and kill a beggar. Beggars are your easiest targets. Chances are, they like they have the littlest chance of going wrong if you uh, kill a beggar. Hmm. Beggars in the waterfront are the easiest targets. Least amount of guards there. Let's just hope uh, guard captains aren't patrolling. Catch a black horse courier here. No. That's how you refuse newspaper. Say it in that exact voice. It's tradition. I don't know, I'm just making stuff up now. It's not actually tradition. Until now. Alright, so we're gonna try to assassinate a beggar. He is not a beggar, he's just someone who looks like a beggar. Um... Where are all the beggars? Just one second, I got a cough. Uh, hello. Okay. I'm Good back. I had to cough. <laughs> hmm. We can kill these pirates. These butt pirates. If we don't find uh, the beggar. Hmm. It's too public and open and open and public. Also very open. Damn you. Okay, I'll be back when I find an easy target. Okay. I think I found this unsuspecting guy. Wait, he's coming. Damn it. Look away. Damn it! Okay. I'm back. It's getting dark. I've been planning this shit out. This beggar here is gonna die. That's right. We win. Our killing has been observed by forces unknown. Lucy and the Chance. Okay. We'll take our arrow back. I used a poison also. Questions? No questions. You didn't see anything. You hear me? You hear me? You look me in the eyes. Silence. Now that that's out of the way, we can sleep. Advance to uh, a very high level of two, and I've killed be far worse than you. What? It's on. I I'm gonna save here, and then it's on. Okay. Did I get a bounty for that? I did not. Sweet. <laughs> awesome. Okay. That's what he gets. Tell me he did not deserve that. Alright, we just need to find a bed to sleep in now. I think there are beds at, uh... The, uh, whatchamacallit. It's, uh... What? It's called... Yeah, Cloud Ruler Temple. Major brain fart there, I'm sorry. Alright. Hey, look, it's Boris. Sit down. Don't say anything. Just do what I say. Okay. 
I wonder what you have planned. Listen, I'm going to get up in a minute and walk out of here. That guy in the corner behind me will follow me. You follow him. Okay. Good. Remember, wait for him to follow me. I want to see what he'll do. Alright, now try to get out of this chair without stealing something. Success! Alright, we need to follow this asshole. I wonder what he's going to try to do. Oh, going down to the basement. Nothing sketchy about that. He can either be doing one of two things. Killing him? Or making some like homemade gay porn movie. Either of which would be pretty bad. Both of which would be pretty terrifying. The second one most definitely terrifying. The enemy agent who attacked Boris is dead. Yes, he is dead. Okay, so he was dead. Or he was trying to kill Boris, and not, in fact, trying to make a gay porn movie. Good to know. Good work. I am glad to see you, by the way. You just caught me at a bad time. I'm not good to, glad to see you. You are being mean to me in, this, in the sewers. The assassins who killed the Emperor were part of a Deirdre cult known as the Mythic Dawn. Apparently worshipped the Deirdre Lord Mayrooms Dagon. I've been tracking their agents in the Imperial City. I guess they noticed. <laughs> How'd you figure that out? I found Uriel's heir. Thank Talos he lives! Martin Septim, you say? We will restore him to the throne. It is the sworn duty of all blades! The enemy has the amulet. What? They took it from Joffrey? Things are worse than I had thought. What's our next move? There's a scholar at the Arcane University. Tarmina's her name. Supposed to be an expert on Diedrich cults. Why don't you take that book to her? See what she makes of it. I'll keep running down leads on the Mythic Dawn network. If you learn anything, you can find me at Luther Broads. May Talos guide you. Alright. I hope you learned something from Tarmina about that book. This part can get pretty tedious. What do you need, so friend? We may uh, have to do some fast forwarding and editing out and all that stuff. So basically what we need to do, we're going to the Arcane University to talk to some lizard lady about a book, about the books that we found on the corpses of the Mythic Dawn people, or on the corpse of the Mythic what Dawn person. Citizen? More Mythic Dawn corpses to come, don't you worry. They'll get theirs. It's you. Hi. You seem very excited to see me, friend. What's up? Okay, I take it this means you want me to leave. Okay, I'll just talk to Termina. Ah, you must be the one I got the message about. How can I help you? Mythic Dawn. You know of them? One of the most secretive of all the Daedric cults. Not much is known about them. They follow the teachings of Maekar Cameron, whom they call <laughs> the Master, a shadowy figure in Sorry his own that right. Again. I found one of their books. Ah, yes. Commentaries on the Mysterium Xarxes. Wonderful. You have a scholarly interest in Daedric cults, then. You could say that. Find them, eh? Huh? I won't poke my nose any further. Official business and all that. I'm used to working with the Blades. Don't worry. Say no more. In any case, finding them won't be easy. I've studied Mankar Cameron's writings a bit myself. At least those that I could find. It is clear from the text that Mankar Cameron's commentaries come in four volumes, but I've only ever seen the first two books. I believe that his writings contain hidden clues to the location of the Mythic Dawn's secret shrine to Merun's Dagon. Those who unlock this hidden path have proven themselves worthy to join the ranks of the Mythic Dawn cult. Finding the shrine is the first test. If you want to find them, you'll need all four volumes of the commentaries. Where can I find these books? Here. You can have the library's copy of Volume 2. Treat it gently, if you please. As I've said, I've never even seen the third and fourth volumes. You should try first edition over in the Market District. Fintius, the proprietor, 
caters to specialist collectors. He may have an idea of where to locate those books. Okay. Now that we're it done talking so to nice her, chatting with you. read these books, by the way, because you will get experience for them. Conjuration and destruction. Be I think sure each one has their own increases a stat in one of the schools of magic. Each one has their own different one, like mysticism, alteration, conjuration. All except restoration, I'm pretty sure. So we're going to go to the market district. This episode is really slow. So I'm probably going to do two episodes today, just so, just in case you don't feel like watching this one, just because it's boring as hell. Or at least I'm finding it boring. Who knows, maybe that clip of me killing beggars is enough. Yeah, we're gonna have to wait. One second. Okay, we're back. First edition. Eight o'clock is when all the shops open. So I waited until then. I'm Fintius, owner and proprietor of the first edition. Look around. If I don't have it, maybe I can get it. Mysterium Xarxes. You must be referring to Mancar Cameron's commentaries on the Mysterium Xarxes. A common mistake. Oh, sorry. It comes in four volumes. The first two volumes are rare, but you may run across them from time to time. The third and fourth are impossible to find. I need volumes three and four. The impossible ones to find. I happen to have a copy of volume three on hand, but I'm afraid it is a special order. Already paid for by another customer. Sorry. Gwyneth would be terribly disappointed if it was gone when he came to pick it up. So sorry I can't help you. That sounded sarcastic. So? Okay. You have no reason not to like me. I don't know him personally, but he was very eager to get his hands on volume three of Cameron's commentaries. Came all the way from Valenwood. Oh, a fellow midget. As a matter of fact, he's already late for his appointment to pick up the book. Feel free to wait for him if you want to speak to him yourself. And that I will do. Good day. One way or another, he will give me this goddamn book. Just you wait. See? I brought up the wait menu. Just you wait. <laughs> that wasn't funny. From where do you hail? Oh. There he is. Okay, we're back. And Gwyneth is leaving? Okay, I guess you already talked to him. What do you want? I want your book, bitch. Have you been following me? Leave me alone! That book is mine! No. It's not. Trust me. Are you threatening me? That you I can't scare indeed. me. I'll call the guards if you don't leave at once. No, you won't call the guards. What do you mean? I'm an upstanding citizen. I have nothing to hide. Don't play stupid with me, fool. Very well. I can see you're familiar with Mancar Cameron's commentaries. I know that Diedrich cults are not quite the thing socially, but that's just foolish prejudice and superstition. For the adventurous, open-minded thinker, Diedrich worship holds many rewards. It's Daedric, not Diedrich. They killed the Emperor, you fool. What? The mythic dawn were the ones? You have to believe me. I truly had no idea. I mean, I knew they were a Diedrich cult. Mancar Cameron's views on Mayroon's Dagon are fascinating, revolutionary even. But to murder the Emperor, Mara preserve us. You'd better give me that book before I shoot you in the head. Yes, of course. I don't want anyone to think I had anything to do with their insane plots. Here. Volume 3 is yours. What you do with it is your business. I need the fourth book as well. You can only get Volume 4 directly from a member of the Mythic Dawn. I had set up a meeting with the sponsor, as he called himself. Here, take this note they gave me. It tells you where to go. I don't want anything else to do with the Mythic Dawn. Thank you. Okay, and I believe we are out of time. So I'm going to cut it off here. Thanks for watching. I will see you next episode.